Hi friends, it's Wendy with Homestyling with Wendy. And today I've decided to venture off to Home Goods. I haven't been there in a while and I want to see what new and wonderful things they've gotten in. But first, I'm on my way to Starbucks. I have to get my iced caramel macchiato. I always do that before I do my shopping hauls and my videos. Kind of gives me a little bit of energy first thing in the morning. It's only nine o'clock, but I like to get to my stores early. So once I get to Starbucks and I'm on my way to Home Goods, when I get there, I will check in with you again. Bye bye. Okay, got my caramel macchiato and I'm here at Home Goods. And I'm gonna go in and see what they have. I like to look at all their different decor accessories. I'm actually in the market for two accent chairs for my bedrooms, but not sure I'm going to do that today. But I'm hoping to get a lot of things on video for you to see. So I'm going in, see you in a little bit, bye-bye. Thank you. 
everyone. I'm back from Home Goods. It was a great trip. Love going there. Every time I go, they have so many different things to look at and to choose from. Right now, I'm going to take you around my house. I have bought some things in the past and some new items. And I want to show you how I have put them in vignettes and I've styled them because it's one thing to buy something, but it's another thing when you have to bring it home and style it in the way you like. So that's next. Here I have three pieces that I bought in Home Goods. The first one is this very large coffee table. It's rustic, it's earthy, it's got all the elements that I just love in my home and it looks wonderful in my TV room. The next thing I bought was this chopping board. They have so many of these in all the stores. You have such a selection to choose from. I just love it here. And to make it look a little different, I have my very rustic bowl. And this again, I bought at Home Goods, and I just like the look of the vignette with my plum flowers right here. You know I'm a plum girl. And that's the first vignette. My next styling moment is this very pretty, abstract, modern, contemporary piece. Uh, I like to mix the contemporary with the earthy and the rustic in my home. And I just saw it at Home Goods and thought, mm, that would look really nice by my fireplace. Now, of course, come on over here. You can't forget the pup in the family. They have a great line of dog products at Home Goods, and my pup needed a, lot, a higher bowl so he wouldn't have to bend down so much. He's getting up there in age, and I think he really likes it. Here in my kitchen, I wanted to show you the chairs that we bought for our island. I was lucky enough that they had three in stock. And again, they're a nice, nice earthy, rustic look with a pop of that nice cream color. They're comfortable and we love the way they look. Over here, we have a Lazy Susan that I bought at Home Goods. I just love the look of it. Again, very weathered wood, rustic. These are not part of Home Goods, but the Lazy Susan is. But again, it's a good idea to show you how I've styled the Lazy Susan. And many times you style with different accessories from different stores. If we can move over here, Mr. Cameraman. Okay, you with me? <laughs> we have another board let me take this off okay here is another cutting board i really like this one part of it is marble and part of it is wood and i keep it on my countertop it's extremely functional when i'm chopping and when i'm not chopping it looks great as an accessory piece here in my dining room I have these two vases that I bought, oh, quite a few years ago, but I really like them so much. And of course I have put, I always forget the name of this stuff, but you know what it is. And I also bought this in Home Goods for a reasonable price. And I put it with this vase because I thought that was a really nice vignette. Now moving over here, I have some wall art that I also purchased in Home Goods. This is a Sarah Brook piece, and you know I'm a fan of Sarah Brook. I love all her work. Uh, this is another piece I bought there. Maybe if I move this down, you can see it better. And that was actually my first purchase. I just loved it. So let's move and hope that doesn't drop. <laughs> Let's move over here. I recently bought this at Home Goods. It's a very tall vase. I really haven't decided where I want to put it yet, so I just put it here for the video. And I did put some uh, forsythias in it because it's forsythia season. And Mr. Cameraman, let's go over here. I did purchase these baskets at Home Goods. Didn't know what to do with them. 
don't go to Home Goods with no idea of what you need. That's what I've learned. It's a big mistake. But I did decide to put them here, and I think they look pretty nice on the steps as an entryway into the dining room. And these are not from Home Goods. I'm sure you recognize them. They're from Target. Uh, but again, we're always combining different items from different stores. That concludes the video for today. I hope you enjoyed going to Home Goods. I hope you enjoyed seeing how I like to create with things I buy from the stores. Please remember to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Have a great week. Stay happy, stay healthy. See you then.